Hey, lad, come here. What's the matter? Ah, nothing's the... I see. We could have a little... Who are you, and... Merchants hire me for protection. That's all you need to know. Hmm. So. All right. Finally. Oi. I have... I'm glad to hear it. Damn it. You got lucky. But then, luck's a part of it too. Take your winnings and go. Have you lost? Bunker! Day to you. Thank you. Coffee with you.
Lad, don't you want a little wager? Greeting. I've got some good. Bye. I'd like to God help. Man cannot live by you find alone, but he can't live without it. Good luck either. to you.
Hey. Yeah. Johanka? Huh? I'm glad to see you. Me too. Well, you're alive, so you're doing well. What's happening? Oh my god. Yes. Actually, uh... Well, now you know. Just the two... Um... Certainly. And it's... I was in a bad... Hmm. How is everyone... Holding up. We don't have enough food or... Doesn't... <laughs> Scholars, maybe. But they leave... Can I have a... Do you now? First, you have to cool it down with water. Marigold ointment helps. And it's better if you don't... Hmm... You do know what you're talking Pulling teeth? Nothing to it. As long as you don't squeeze the pincers too hard. Well, go and see if anyone needs anything. Mm. <laughs> too bad the cust- Is the custode? All the time. And, um... What do you mean, what? I could do something. <sighs> no. Doesn't the- They give us some food- Anything- Look around- Well, it is a lot- Crowd- mm. I tried that. Do you have enough? Enough to survive, maybe. Maybe if that. Hmm. Why is there? He's here. Because of you. Yes. There was one time I just had enough of it all, of the way they. Tr what can? He's and that. All right. L last we des. I'll do what. You're the one who. Yes, monks so old. Oh, if that bad, I shouldn't talk like that. I'd like to. Hmm. A bit of everything. Can you now? I do. In that case, you've come to the right place. <laughs> Go to the. Clear. Not. Those plants have. I see. Once you've cleared. Don't worry. Stay here. How are the... Some of the others... It's a good... Well, there were... If only... A... You were there? God be merciful! To you... How can I... Have you talked to you? I did. Well, if you know... That's true. I'm the son of a blacksmith. But I have been around the wounded before. 
Come and speak to me. What do you think of Baron? And the I hear Thank you. Please help me. Would you teach certain? Well. Mart! Oh, he's run off again. Oh dear.
Where is that dog? Oh, he's run off. I hope he comes back. Surrender! You will have to answer Enough. for your law break. You were sick. You should have. Good app.
a bridge. That'll make it easier to cross the earthworks. There's open ground on both sides of it, but it's the fastest route for an attack. Yeah. A moat. It would take a while to get across, and there's nowhere to shelter from arrows. You're in the wrong place at the wrong time. Stockade. A handful of men could hold it for quite a while. Good ground for a big fight, and there's not much cover. Look at that. These heathens are a lot tidier than the bandits. I'm reach out for hiding.
Yeah. Well, I never. The pig turned up willingly for the slaughter. You'll get. Ugh! <laughs> 
You may have. I'd like to see you try shooting these now. The fewer arrows you have the better for us. The secret is in the spices.
They can see a long way from that steeple. And those archers up there, definitely going to be a problem.
takes the bravest men in the whole province much their strength. The Lord be praised. I'd like to... Of course. All right. And I... Lord. Good. The first combatant will be Henry Scullin from the company of the Ratsay Kabla. And his adversary will be Yera of Benashoff, called Kippa, a mercenary by profession. Let us wish the combatants luck. The combatants have entered the arena and the first duel may commence. We will witness a duel with longswords. time to choose weapons for the next duel. Prepare to watch a fierce fight with axes and shields. Entering the arena now will be Thaddeus, commander of the guard at Tomberg. And he will face Henry of Skeletts from the company of Sarate Kabla. Let us wish the combatants luck. And this very first bout will afford plenty of entertainment. We will witness a duel with longswords.
The second bout will surely be no less exciting. This one may decide the winner. Prepare to watch a fierce fight with axes and shields. What's up? for the second bout. Our confidence will demonstrate their skills with short sword and shield. Ah! <laughs> 
over here. have been chosen by our gracious Sir Hannah. Prepare to watch a fierce fight with axes and shields.
And ladies, good men and good wives, you have just witnessed the final duel in today's Ratai Tournay, for which we all owe gratitude to Sir Hanush of Laipa. All glory to the victor, Henry of Skelets, man at arms in the company of Sir Radzik Komila. His prize will be given to him by our gracious Sir Hanush. Health. I've got some goods. All right.
Let's talk about the price. Yeah. Ha! <laughs> 
Greetings, Henry. I hear you on the Rat Eye Tourney. Well done, lad. I'm back from scouting, sir. Excellent. What have you found out? There's an overgrown ruined village in the woods where they're dug in. That sounds like Pribislavitz. It used to belong to Sir Divish before Havel Madig attacked and torched it, and then imprisoned Divish. It's been left abandoned ever since. I was hoping they wouldn't be so organized. Earthworks and fortifications. That's quite a different matter from writing some rabble out of the woods. I tried to count them. And how many of them are there? Bear in mind I'm relying on what you say. We'll have to call for reinforcements, and that's no simple matter. Every man that comes with us will be lacking somewhere else. And I don't want bandits pillaging some other town because there's no one left to mount a defense. There's quite a few of them there. Perdition. We'll definitely need reinforcements. I think the Talmberg men should suffice. I don't like leaving the castle unprotected, but there's no other option. There aren't just bandits in the camp. There are Cumans, too. Quite a few of them. Cumans, you say? Where the hell did they come from? Could Sigismund have left them there after he raised Scalitz? This is looking more and more serious. It's mostly bandits in the camp. They're not villagers with pitchforks, but not regular soldiers either. <laughs> no more than I expected. I have no fear of them. But underestimating the enemy can be fatal. I took a look at their arms and armour. They're not a proper army, but they're equipped quite well. What about archers? There's a few of them, and they're positioned well. If we charge them head on, they'll probably do us a lot of damage. I don't like the sound of that. It complicates the situation. Dealing with them before the battle would be the best option. They're up to something in the middle of the camp. It looked like they were making several long ladders. Ladders? That sounds like they're planning a siege. I like this less and less. On the other hand, we can use that to our advantage. If we can capture those ladders, we can use them to scale their own fortifications. That's about all I saw. That's all right. Did you... I managed to slip poison to a few of them. We should be too sick to fight. You're as cunning as a fox. We need more. I managed to destroy... Well done. That's, That's also. Don't worry, Henry. I need you to go to Sir Divish in Talmberg and tell him to send... You can rely on me, sir. Tell him to take... All right, I'll get going. And be quick. We've no time to... Yeah. 
Greetings. What do you need? Sir Radzik sent me with an important message. He needs more men? The bandits and humans have set up camp in Pribislavit. Hang on. Easy now. I managed to track down the camp of the bandits who raided Neuhof. But it's not just a gang of brigands. More like a small arm. I don't know what they're up to, but I'm sure they're getting ready for something. And Sir Radzik wants to destroy... So it's worse than I thought. But Sir Radzik is right. We should do something... Sir Radzik said to take all your men and leave only a minute. What? Every... There really are a lot of them, Sir Divish. He's leaving the camp almost empty, too. We're... All right, then. Sir Radzik knows... Would you leave my men... Yes, sir. May God be with you in battle. Farewell. I'm glad to see you, Captain Robard. I hope Henry's explained everything to you. He did, but I find it hard to believe. Who could possibly put together such a significant military force, and right under our noses? We'll just have to find out, but I don't think we will until after a... I agree entirely, my lord. Right, lad. We're almost at the place you described. Now we'll have to advance cautiously. I need you to tell me how it looks around the... Sir, that's a big responsibility. I asked you a question, boy. There are three ways to get in. Directly... Let's start with the direct... That path leads round their battlements. It's for... It's a good thing you're here. What about the approach through the woods and the weir? I don't... That's a long way... I thought so. What about the last approach, over the bridge? It's a bit narrow for my liking. It's narrow, all right. But once we get over, we can quickly occupy the best ground for a battle. The battleground sounds inviting. It's not an easy decision. I try to answer to the battle. And you'll be suitably rewarded. From what you say, the route over the bridge is the best option. If we're fast, we'll have the... With the help of God, we'll win this day. We'll approach from the south and storm them over the bridge. Form up. Forward march. Go, go, go! Thank you. 
give him that! my fucking sword. What the fuck are you on about? What's... Hang on. You're the... Fuck me. I thought we left you to the crows. Tough little fucker, eh? What did you do with my sword? Judging by our last encounter, I'd say you made a big mistake. Where's my fucking sword? But then again, maybe you've had some practice. I hope so. Because last time was too easy. I'd say you're flogging a dead horse there. You took him down. On your own. Well done. Nice work. You surprised me. He was a mountain of a man. He was the one who attacked Noyov. And stole your sword, sir. The thought did cross my mind. What did he tell you? taken him alive, the executioner might have gotten more out of him. Oh well, these things happen in the heat of battle. Anyway, we found a trunk full of coin down below. Someone was paying this gang very well. You know, some of Sigismund's barbarians among them. I don't think we've seen the last of this. Whoever engineered it was highly placed. They won't give up after one defeat. This louse was just a pawn. I'm afraid you're right, sir. Well, lad, you live to fight another day, eh? Oh, 
That's the fear leaving you, lad. Let it go. Now, put it all behind you. A decent Christian shouldn't dwell on such horrors. I beg to differ, sir. I never want to forget this. The time has come for those whore sons to pay for what they did to us. You're right, my boy. But first, we all need some rest. We'll meet later in the upper castle in Rate, and then decide what to do next. Come what may, you did a good job today. I will make you pay for this. It's time for the next part of our plan. Give the word. Yes, sir. No use begging. I'll give no quarter to filthy murdering heathens. Give us a three bonds! That's it! 
Finn! Yeah! God bless. Can I be a Henry? I sent him. What's up? You're a yeah. What? Well, it's we. A few. I'd a take care now.
Ja. So, this what is? Who are you? I'm Henry, and I was what? So Divish's locator went missing around. Well, it seems like he's all out of luck, don't it? Divish ought to have said he didn't send me to Parley. Deal with it. There's plenty of us, and you're on your own. Let him go, or you can stay like the rabble who were. All right, all right. We'll be on our way then. That fella's in the tent. Thank you. My pleasure. God's truth. I'm Henry of Scalip. My name is Marius Bielek, Master Locator. Sir Divish sent me here to Sir... Well, the outlaws are out. Not just... Those bastards caught me as soon as I arrived. And so far all I've seen is the... Come along with me if you like. Wonder... It's not meant to be fun. I... Don't go too far. I'll look things over. See what... At least I'll get it done faster and... What? By... I'll have to measure it out. Hmm. So, Master Locator. There's a long way to go before that. It's all overgrown with brush. Oh dear. We'll have to get it all clear. So it is possible? Yes. But building a whole village... Hmm. We'll need timber. Lots of it. 
which isn't a problem. We'll have to hire wage labor to begin with. Hmm. I think we should get started with... I can just imagine... Oh, that's good news. My wait. I'll head to town. But would you keep an eye on things here in the... No problem. It shouldn't take us long. My lord, welcome to Pribislavitz. Well, what's left of... Not to worry, Ma. <sighs> I'm glad to... Although, it seems to have... I beg to differ, sir. It's quite dilapidated, unlike your good self. But at least... Thanks in part to Henry here. Who, who knows? If it hadn't... Well, lad, uh, just as you said... I did my best, sir. They didn't look all that tough, so I put a bit of pressure on them and they took to their heat. You were outnumbered and you scared them off. Nah, they were greenhorn. I think they may have been a bit intimidated by me. Let's hope they don't try anything like that again. I'm quite sure they won't. Let's get down to the... Sir, in my official capacity as locator, I am gratified to inform you that the hamlet... Splendid. Finally, some good news. I'm badly... So, what have you discovered so far? We had a scout around. We conducted a basic survey, from which we can make... I already have in my head an initial plan. We should certainly have a... I'd like to preserve the... Ex that should present no serious obstacles. The building is in much better condition than we anticipate. That's to be ex... But there's... Yes, and there are abundant woods around. Clearing them will provide both extra land and timber supplies that we can use right away. Right now, I believe we're standing on the... The future green, that is. The village centre will comprise at least... We can't fit any more, so there will be other buildings away from the square. In... I'm glad to hear it. The building work later will clear and build more farmhouses. But... For now, we'll have to focus on more sensible goals. As... But rebuilding a whole village must cost the king's ransom, though. It's true it won't come cheap. Before the tradesmen settle here and start producing and trading. A certain amount? I wouldn't venture to state a... Well, that much? We shall, of course, attempt to procure everything. Nevertheless, I... Where... I... Which... It... There'll be... A... It... When... Right... If... True... I... Eh... What... I'm a so, my lord. You <laughs> true. You said, uh, and as so, he'll at and and so. What? Before we can start building as much as an outhouse, we'll have to get the whole area cleared. Right. So I suppose I'd better get... Indeed. I'm sure the bailiff will be more than happy. I'll stay...
This? So what? Hmm. It says I should. I'm so right. Hmm. See you later. Hear ye, hear ye. It is hereby announced, in the name of Sir Hanush and Sir Divish, that you, the citizens of Ratai, as well as those who have found temporary refuge here, are permitted to move to the hamlet of Pribislavitz, to the north of Tomberg Castle, wherein you shall be vouchsafed a new life and new dwellings, providing that you shall contribute to the renewal of the hamlet. All those who choose to accept this offer shall be exempted from payment of taxes for a period of five years. They shall be permitted also to make use of timber from the surrounding woods and water from the streams. The hamlet of Pribislavitz lies in the domain of Sir Divish of Talmberg, and all who settle there shall be duty-bound to him. It is furthermore hereby announced that Henry of Skalitz is appointed to the administration of Pribislavitz and the office of bailiff therein, which office and privilege have been conferred upon him by Sir Divish for loyalty and services rendered. I would therefore recommend that our Skalitz friends consider this offer very seriously as nothing better is likely to come your way anytime soon. Greetings, good night. Goodbye.
Welcome back. What news from Ratai? Well, the bailiff read Sir Divish's decree, and now I'm officially bailiff of Pribislavitz. Then allow me to congratulate you. First, I'll, um... As it happens, I already saw... You might have noticed that the first... Yeah, I saw some heading here right away. So when they arrived, I was able to start clearing build... After they'd erected some temporary dwellings... So we're ready to get... As long as you know what you want to build, we'll be building on the sites we've measured out. You can... I'll do that. Nevertheless, I doubt you'll be able to figure that... How do I... I've already... Thanks. What about... The... the... Uh, I... Well, as you said yourself, it's just a continuation of your work for us to divish. So I see no reason to change the conditions now. Even though it's much more work and res- All right. This amount ought to correspond to your work. It seems we understand each other. I agree. Good. Are you sure it's quite- Quite. Only you and I shall have a- key. Ah. That's if you I want to build- Certainly. We'll need woodcut- it's impossible. I'd rather not build them. to build so we'll need wood so they We're going to build here. Yes. I'm ready. I'll... 
All good. I want to build not very well. So they don't We're gonna build right here. I'm ready. I'll I want to build some traders very well, so they don't. We're going to build here. Indeed. Can we begin? I'm ready. I'll just quickly check again that we have everything. Hmm. We've got what we need. So, you you run or could you? How did mm -hmm. that win and I how ever you sure? How can I win? How can I? I although I mm -hmm. right. Um, 
How do the the more you match each other? As you the basic core. Nothing, actually. Look out! Gods! Yeah. I must put the to what the Alright.
God be with you. I'm well, look well, and I find it. Have I've got this? Couldn't we do? Sorry, I can't, Henry. This is the. I'll farewell. I'll be with you. Are you in? Uh, I'm. Now you. Uh, I don't. Axe. Take care now. Could you. Up. Gotcha. And. Up. Uh, Rock. And. I've got good. So. Must uh, help you. I will. By the Lord, watch out. Yeah. Greetings, good night. A lot of them on have a on the app of you at a back deal or take care. I'll chop! Yeah! 
I'm over here. Come in.
Quick! Get him! Yeah! I hope I can be a help to you. I want to build something. Let's build a book. Good.
We're gonna build here. I'm ready. Up. Uh, we've Well, something oh, here about no, us. I didn't know she did that. I'm honored. See you later. I want to build something. Then you'll have to put the amount net. And what if I don't? Then production will grind. Watch out. You I want to build. If we build. Very well.
We're gonna build. Right. I'm right up. Uh, hmm. We've. St God! Yeah. God almighty.
See you later. Yeah. I want to build, sir. We'll need plenty. Let's go to the sun. We're going to build here? Indeed. I'm ready. I'll just quickly check again that we have everything we need. Hmm. All good. We can start construction. So, how am I doing with the village? Let's see. Hmm. Hmm. You're still far from having the income you need to make the village prosper. You'll need to get the tradesmen working better and creating space for more people. The church is still in ruins. Doesn't create a good impression. We're on the right track, but we haven't reached the end yet. All right, I'll get stuck in. Could you explain? Nothing, that's... Yeah.
God bless you. What troubles you? I'd like to enroll. All right. Of course. Up. Up. Lock. Good. Take care. Meeting face to face in this round will be. Denye, apprentice to the Ratai scribe. And his adversary will be Henry of Skeletts from the company of Sir Rate Kabla. Let us wish the combatants luck. The combatants have entered the arena and the first duel may commence. We will witness a duel with long swords. for the second bout. The combatants will engage in a duel with war hammers and shields. Henry of Skelets from the company of Sarate Kabla. 
And his adversary will be... Obram, known as Spudderhawk, Archery Master of Kalin. Let us wish the combatants luck. All is prepared for the first duel. We will witness a duel with longswords. And now's the time to choose weapons for the next duel. Our warriors will fight with hunting swords. Meeting face to face in this round will be Henry of Skelets from the company of Sarazi Kabla, who will measure his skills against Menhart, master swordsman from far off Frankfurt. Welcome, our warriors. And this very first bout will afford plenty of entertainment. We will witness a duel with longswords. Yes. 
for the second bout. The combatants will engage in a duel with war hammers and shields. I certainly am, my lord. God save you!
Yeah. Sir, a word if you please. What is it? I'd like to challenge you to a duel. Why not? Excellent. I see you have no fear. Come and get it. <laughs> <laughs> Oh dear, did that 
What's the matter here? This bitch here tried to kill me. Have a clapped in the s- That's not true, Master Bailiff, sir. He got drunk, like he always does, and ate who knows what kind of slop somewhere. You know very well what it was what poisoned me. You're trying to get rid of me and don't think I don't know it. Enough. One at a time. Tell me what happened. What makes you think she tried to poison you? She hates me. She wants to put me in the ground and then take the farm. I can see it in her eyes. She's just wishing for the day I'm dead. But she'll never see it, because I'll throw her out on her ear. Throw me out? From my own home? You useless, ale-swilling pig. Have you forgotten who got you a roof over your head? Just look at her, sir. You can see for yourself what a harpy she is. I came home after one or two ales at the tavern. 
ate my supper, what was left on the table for me, and went to bed. And in the morning, I woke up with my guts in agony. My head was on fire. I thought my last hour had come. If it wasn't for the old herb woman, she'd already have me in the... Have you forgotten the part about battering me and throwing up in the door? Shut your mouth, you... Quiet. Good wife, tell... Sir, that beast is good for nothing but drinking away my dowry with his cronies. If he puts his hand to a flail at... We were thrown out of the farm near Ledechko that I got as a dowry because this fool let it go to ruin and got us into debt too. They threw us out because you wouldn't back me up. Because I couldn't hold my head up if I lied to cover you. That's got nothing to do with you poisoning me. He boozes from morning till night and beats me. Says I don't. And all he does is sit on his ass expecting me to run around cooking and cleaning for... And now he wants to drive me out of the village saying I tried to kill him. What would I do? What do you think happened? Nothing what hasn't been a hundred times before. He was crooked as a bishop again, and I could already hear him in the... I had his supper waiting on the table, because only there's no pleasing the pig. Where's the meat? And what have you. And when I told him God's honest truth, that there's no meat, because he drank all our money away... One slap was all you got. What was less than you deserved? I ran off and hid in the barn till he'd calmed down. After a while, he started throwing up and he was spewing till dawn. Who knows what he ate when he was boozed up. And what about the herb woman? I went for her in the end. Three groschen I had to give her for some wormwood potion. I could have done that myself for nothing. And then he claimed... Tell me about how you... I came home and there was a bowl of cabbage soup and a pitcher of wine on the table. I woke up in the early hours and had to run to the outhouse, spewing and this witch here laughing up her sleeve. She wouldn't even call the herb woman. If I had to call the herb woman every time you get boozed... When I was writhing in agony on the ground, I heard her say clear as day, Ha! You go... Is that true? No, he's... Now, I've heard enough. You, farmer, won't touch another drop of booze or I'll leave you in the stocks to dry out. And if you raise your hand to your wife again, I'll take a bludgeon to you. But a drink or two? No buts. There'll be no half measures with you. Thank you, Master Bailey. Thank you a thousandfold. Thank you.